Hi, I'm Marie, and this is how I paint the beautiful details on these rather dramatic peonies. With this one, I'm starting with the striking markings of pink on the white petals. And I build up the texture and surface pattern here in layers, increasing the depth of my colour at times to enhance the contrast in order to build up an interesting and textured surface. Once I've painted in all of the main pink areas, I move on to painting with various grey tones that I use to create the shape and form of my petals. So this is where I pull the whole petal together and really define its shape and place on the flower. I pay special attention to any shadows created by overlapping or overhanging petals, as this really adds depth to the flower. And as I go along, I add in any extra little details that I find on the small little petals. So coming to this little petal here, this is a particularly interesting and fun one to paint as it has a lot of surface pattern and different colours on it. So I'm going to show you how I build up this textured surface. I apply my pink patterning first, just very delicately using the very tip of my brush and painting onto a slightly damp surface so that my edges remain soft. Then I add in my mid-green and I vary the hue of my green accordingly. So adding a little more yellow where the colour is brighter. and all the time coming back in with a damp brush to make sure that I blend the edges of these patterns and colours softly into the background. And then I come back in again over the top with a more saturated and slightly darker mix of my colour to begin building up the layers that will create depth and contrast on the petal surface. So it's these contrasting details that give your painting depth and really bring it to life, creating a truly beautiful and interesting three-dimensional image. If you would like to have a go at the full step-by-step -step tutorial of this peony and many others, you can come over and take a look at the Watercolour Members Club, where I have 75 plus step-by-step -step watercolour tutorials instantly available when you join up. And there's also plenty of help and support when you need it as well. The link is below and there's a free tutorial if you'd like to give that a go first. Well thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more of my upcoming tips and technique videos. So goodbye for now and have a lovely day.